Former President Jacob Zuma will not be voting for the ANC in the upcoming election as he is supporting the MK party. He adds that he will not be campaigning for the governing party and speaking through his daughter, Duduzile Zuma. The former president says the ANC has been reduced to an organization that has lost its moral compass. It Among the reasons why I take this decision was that I realized this is not what I take for. Yeah. I need to see a South Africa that our ancestors envisaged to say this can be free. There is more poverty. There is more problems. There is more criminality. All you have to just tell you about how much this time things that be. There is no solution why I will not stop criminality in our country. We pay tax for those who must do the job. And they must do the job. We need to rescue the ANC and bring it back to the organization that we know, love, and trust. This requires drastic action. Before stating what that we are going to do to rescue and restore the real ANC vision, let me tabulate a few of the current pressing issues on which I base my distrust of the current ANC of Ramaphosa as a proxy of white monopoly capital, which must be distinguished from the real which must be distinguished from the real ANC. Firstly, the ANC kept quiet when the powers of the president were taken away in the appointment of the chair of the commission on the so-called state capture. This symbolized an opportunistic amendment of the constitution of South Africa. Secondly, the ANC kept quiet when it became clear that the 2017 national conference and the position of president had been stolen or bought by forces outside the organization for an amount of 300 million rand, which the president admitted under oath, found by the public protector in her Bosasa report in which Ramaphosa was fingered. Thirdly, the turning point for me was a misguided statement made by the ANC president that the ANC is accused number one for corruption in South Africa. Neither the leadership of the ANC and the NEC nor the membership at the most recent national conference saw the need to challenge or change that incorrect statement. Fourthly, the ANC expelled its Secretary General using the selective application of the so-called step-aside rule, but will now allow the President, who is also facing criminal charges, to top its list for the next election. Fifthly, the ANC stood idle when 400 black people were massacred in KwaZulu-Natal following the avoidable July 2021 unrest caused by the Constitutional Court and Mr. Raymond Zondo due to my imprisonment without trial under the ANC of Ramaphosa. Sixthly, the, straw, the last straw was when, due to the public protector's 31 questions in the investigation of the Palapala scandal, she was suspended and then impeached by the ANC, DA and Freedom Front working together. I have now been told that the ANC of Ramaphosa has decided to vote in favor of the impeachment of Judge President Thope and Judge Motata. The ANC of Ramaphosa has declared war against progressive black professionals and intellectuals.